Okay, now back to Ethan, who has apparently unlocked a new bonus. It's a training card of Jason. <laughs> <laughs> now he's out of print, it'll be super rare. <laughs> oh god, oh god. <laughs> 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 oh, oh god, sorry. Give me the first <laughs> idea that pops into your head. Okay, um, this looks like a, a butterfly, butterfly, I'd say. Yeah, I'd say that, yeah. That clearly looks like a wolf. I was gonna say fox. That looks like a crab to me. Yep. That this one's bullshit, because that's clearly the Grim Reaper. Yeah. All of those yeah. kind of had the same connotation. Apparently I'm feeling terror right now. No wonder, this room looks like something out of freaking Assassin's Creed. Oh, you've got, you're anxious now. That's me, whenever I, I start recording, really. I have the results of your MRI scan. Starts at anxiety and goes straight to terror. physical <laughs> damage from the accident. However, I am worried about your psychological condition. Yeah, uh, seeing your son, <coughs> who you were trying to protect, die, uh, would kind of have a lasting impression on you. Just a little bit. It's my fault Jason is dead. Okay, David, I don't need to see Ethan's every single emotion, okay? Accidents happen every day. You can't blame yourself. I like how the, the scanner's like, sadness, 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 as if it wasn't obvious. How is Sean? Sean hates me. I know he's Ooh, really affection, what the fuck does that say? <laughs> he loves his son, but he's sad about their relationship. Uh, oh, affection, sadness, yes. What about you, Ethan? That sounds like a good band think? name. How do I feel? How do I feel? Dead. That's how I feel. Jason did. Except I actually went on living, unlike Jason. And that car ran into <laughs> oh my god, is this a training car? And it's shiny! So I can look at it and distract myself from the fear and the pain! <laughs> shiny Jason! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, oh Jesus. Yeah, I've been having these really weird blackouts. blackouts. Have you by any chance been purchasing alcohol from the pound store? <laughs> Why is the psychoanalyst suddenly David Cage? <laughs> Surprise, I'm every character. I'm not Ethan. Jason. Jason. <laughs> I, I'm Norman Jaden. Look at my sunglasses. Fuck you, Blake. Everyone. <laughs> You suffered a massive concussion and were in a coma for six months. You said there was no lasting damage from the, the incident. No, it said there was no lasting physical damage. Oh, okay. But com comas and things like that are psychological because your brain just uh, we'll goes, fuck this noise. How far in the future are we exactly? Because it seems like it could be our time, yet they have technology that's... Supposedly, uh, at least I would say half a decade in the future. Spoilers, it's 20 double X. In 20 double X, heavy rain was beginning. Someone set us up the plot. <laughs> you have no chance to survive. <laughs> Hello, gentlemen. <laughs> Move zig. Move zig. Do you want to eat something? Problem, Sean? Problem, <laughs> No, I'm alright. That was my favourite episode of that show, and it will never be shown again. It's out of syndication now. How did things go at school today? I was punished because I didn't do my homework. Oh, oh god. Lasting effects due to my choices. Heavy rain. <laughs> Do you want to play on the seesaw? I don't feel like Do you want to just sit here and wallow in sadness? Do you want to sit here and look at the shiny trading card of you? No, no, okay. <laughs> I'll put that back. Well, see you, Sean. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. 
I haven't been on a seesaw in a long time. What do you think? Yeah. Oh, now you care. The way he was looking at that seesaw and talking, it made him think, you know, um, Francis York Morgan, when he talks to himself, but he, it, there's like a second regard, so it's just like, well, Tom, what do you think? I don't know, York. <laughs> You're talking to yourself. Now, is he pumping for oil, or is he stimulating affection towards his son? We'll never know. Or is he on a minecart track trying to outrun a train? <laughs> I'm sure I've played that minigame before. <laughs> Whoosh! Straight into the stratosphere. <laughs> Spoilers, the train is his emotion. It's going to kill him in the end. It doesn't take much to impress you, does it, Sean? <laughs> Social rank up! Alright, come on then. <sighs> yes, the merry go round. Yeah. Fucking love merry go rounds. Yeah. So fast you won't be able to stay on it. Great. You know, incidentally, my favourite fairground ride, not playground ride, fairground now, is the waltzes. Because I got a fear of heights, but uh, I don't mind spinning round really, really fast on the ground. I keep forgetting there's different types of inputs. He has just follow it round. <laughs> <laughs> and the slow pan is disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I fucking love you, David Cage. Sean's face then was just like, Dad, you are such a fucking disappointment. Okay, now we're going to go like round so fast, it'll be like Superman turning back time. <laughs> I'll get Jason back one way or another. <laughs> No, 1990, 1980, 1970, 1080, hey Jesus, <laughs> year zero. It's your kids, Ethan. It's about your kids. When this merry-go-round hits 88 miles an hour, you're going to see some serious shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Whoa. I think my head is spinning. Slightly like tails in uh, Sonic Heroes, though. Well, my hair's spinning. Excuse me, whilst I just wash my ears out with bleach. Bless it. Sonic Heroes tried. Didn't do very well, but God forbid it tried. You want to go play on the swing? I'll push you. Okay. He's surprisingly open to all of these. <laughs> yeah, considering that, you know, he hated his dad for, like, yesterday. <laughs> that was a very slow, assuming the swing position. <laughs> Let it fly. <laughs> Sorry, this isn't Big Blood. <clears throat> you threw me off there. You gotta pick up speed, Tom, you're running out of time. You're a weakling, Dad. A fucking weakling. <laughs> Take two, I guess, LOL. Why'd you stop? This is why I do games in post for the most part. If I get this wrong enough times, will he hate me even more? Possibly. Do you want to find out? Got it. Whee! Yes! <laughs> I'm doing it, guys. I'm pushing my song on the swings. <laughs> and around the bars he goes. That's enough fun. <laughs> Don't want to play that game anymore. <laughs> the game where you send me over the bars. That was the saddest swing set experience I've ever seen. <laughs> Not just because I can't do it worth a shit. Uh, no, no, there's more frivolities over here. Come on. Love me, Sean! <laughs> Love me! Sean! Sean! Alright, oh, I need a son first, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've got the shiny trick. No, put the training card away, Ethan. 
And sometimes he just walks where he wants to. It's a little bit better than Indigo Prophecy, where it felt like David Cage was standing off screen with a magnet at all times. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like rain's coming. Uh oh. I think we better. Are we about to drop the title? Okay. No, nah, this is just a light drizzle. Oh okay. The prologue to this game. You know, I didn't mean what I said before. Damn straight, you didn't. I mean, I that's very mature of you, Sean. Be angry. I wasn't very nice to you either. Oh, look at this father and son bonding moment. Don't don't look at me, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me also think that David Cage is like the camera operator for this game. That's why it's so shonky, because he's always drunk off his ass. <laughs> Excuse me, what word did you just use? Shonky. <laughs> shonky. Hey Dad, can I have a ride on the carousel? Can I? Okay, so the carousel. It's mandatory. It's not like an optional side quest. I'll take ten. One, please. That's a dollar. Didn't have any carousels in any parks back in my day. Tell me about it. Well, that's America. They've got a shit ton more space. See you in hell, Dad! Suddenly the carousel starts spinning faster and faster. He hears static coming through a radio hidden behind the bushes. And suddenly the grass is red, there is blood pouring from the sky, and Pyramid Head appears behind him. We're in Silent Hill! <laughs> and the last thing Ethan hears of Sean is Silent Hill! <laughs> that movie was surprisingly okay. Hang on, hang on. Was I partially correct about the world going to shit when he got on the carousel? What? Uh, Ethan's world is perpetually... In shit. Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god! Well, that's how my story ends! <laughs> Jesus! I wasn't expecting that. The thing about games like these, though, is that since David Cage says game overs are the failure of the game designer, you can very rarely have lasting consequences. So even if I miss one, it'll probably give me another try. Or if you do have a consequence, it won't reveal itself until the very end. Sean, what street is this? What's the area code? Are we even in the US anymore? Okay, this scene just fades out because it couldn't be asked to do a little <laughs> transition. God, how long was I out? This park's out of business. <laughs> Are you still on the carousel? <laughs> Park rules. No losing son. <laughs> My boy's a bag. Damn you. A bag. <laughs> Just collapses to his knees and puts his fist to the sky. You bastard. <laughs> This is something truly beautiful that I am witnessing right now. Beautiful or annoying? Beautifully annoying. You know, even these things exist called cars. They can get you to where you need to go much quicker. Best start printing those Sean trading cards. <laughs> <laughs> there is one ultra rare card. Damn you, Chihuahua! Damn you! <laughs> Jesus, that mouth animation. I just hate Ethan, okay? I hate him. <laughs> I want to see him suffer. <laughs> 